Are you a fan of comic wall arts? Then Brussels, the capital of Belgium, is the destination for you. Since 1991, the walls of the capital have been regularly adorned with new murals, and today there are over 80 comic wall arts. Many museums, galleries, flea markets, festivals, and specialized shops are entirely devoted to the comic strip. But one of the most amazing activities is undoubtedly the famous comic strip trails. In this video, I will take you through the comic trail of Lekin and Heron. Far from the hustle and bustle of the tourist center, they offer numerous green spaces and addresses frequented almost exclusively by locals. The city of Brussels has inaugurated this mural as part of its street art trail, and it was made in memory of George Floyd, who was killed by a police officer during his arrest on 25 May 2020 in Minneapolis, USA. The mural, created by artist Nova Dead, pays tribute to all victims of discrimination. Martine is the title character in a series of books for children originally written in French. The first album, Martine at the Farm, was published in 1954. This wall art represents Martine running in nature with his dog, Patapouf. The French comic strip author known as Mezzo is the creator of this wall art known as King of the Flies. On the backdrop is a tomium and cages of King Kong, Minotaur, and Yeti, and a young boy in blue jersey with Batman logo seems to have known Yeti and helped him escape the cage. The Belgian artist, known as Nian, was the creator of this wall art. This was created as a part of a Red Cross campaign to raise awareness about stem cell donation. The art represents two people, a mother and her son, who live in the neighborhood. This illustration shows a fresco of Belgian actress and singer, Annie Cordy. She appeared in more than 50 films from 1954 and staged many memorable appearances. This 160 square meter fresco is known as the cabin. The fresco depicts seven women of different physiques and origins in an environment of trees and water. It highlights the importance of working together. This seven meters high and five meters wide mural, Yomeke, tells the adventures of two children who enjoy all kinds of adventures with Professor Gobeline and his parrot Flip. Many neighborhood features and monuments have been included in the design. Natasha is a Belgian comic series. The main character, Natasha, the air hostess, is much more than just a pretty blonde. This is a determined young woman with a highly developed sense of justice. An adventure of the private detective Gil Jordan is illustrated in this wall art. Gil Jordan is a Belgian detective comic strip created by Maurice Atiliux. The mural is called Solastalgie. It means the suffering caused by the disruption of the climate and its consequences. This was a creation of Eva Roussel, a French author and illustrator who is sensitive to climate change and current social issues. Tamara is set in a scene that's typical of the festivities in Lecan. Every year, it celebrates the winter solstice, that day of the year when the night is longer than the day. The people of Laken celebrate the imminent return of light with a splendid parade of lanterns. This mural is one of the most popular comic strip heroes, Titiouf, recognizable from his excessive blonde quiff. On the mural, Titiouf looks at his distorted reflection in one of the Atomium's balls. The Marsupalami, famous friend of Spiro since 1952, joined the comic strip walk of Brussels in 2013. It is on the wall of a police station in the area. 
This comic route is about seven kilometers, and it will take about four hours to complete. Except from the specified wall arts, you can see many more wall arts around the trail. So, my dear friends, I will meet you again in another new video of Beauty of the World. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel.